Hey everyone, this is Steve from Taxopress. Taxopress is the plugin you want if you have a lot of tags, categories, and terms on your site. It really helps you organize all your content and keep all your terms relevant and useful. If you have a busy WooCommerce site, it can be difficult to organize all your products, and that's the kind of site that Taxopress is designed for. With Taxopress, it's really easy to automatically add relevant and useful tags and categories to your WooCommerce products. In this video, I'm going to show you how that's done. I have a site set up that already has a whole set of WooCommerce product categories. Apples, bananas, carrots, eggs. These are the examples I'm going to use here. And to make this work, we're going to use Taxopress and we're going to use the Auto Terms feature. Now by default, there's going to be one of these set up as soon as you install Taxopress. You're just going to need to modify the existing example. So I'm going to click on Edit here. And I'm going to go to the General tab. And I'm going to choose the taxonomy that I need to work with here, which is going to be Product Categories. Then I can choose the Post Types. It's not going to be Posts. It's going to be products. And then I should be good to go. I may want to quickly consult with the sources tab. There's a few options here. In the free version, the option is to add existing terms. So any existing terms, like the ones you saw a few moments ago, apple, banana, and so on, those are existing taxonomy terms and Taxopress will scan the content and search for them and add them if it finds them. In the pro version of Taxopress, you can connect Taxopress to some other more advanced services that will add new and relevant terms instead of existing terms. But that's a topic for another day. In this video, we're going to demonstrate scanning and adding existing terms. So I'm gonna make sure that I've clicked on save, and now I'm going to go to products and add a new product. And I'm gonna call this Fruit basket. And this isn't the most sophisticated example here, but you can see how it works. And over here, we have the empty categories that have not been selected yet. Apples, bananas, carrots, and eggs. So I'm looking for TaxoPress to scan the content and automatically check three of those boxes for me using the auto terms feature. So publish. And there we go. We've automatically scanned all of these except for carrots. And I've added carrots. I've updated the content and carrots is now filled in. This is a really useful feature if you're adding a lot of content, a lot of products to your site. It's one less thing to worry about. Taxopress will work in the background and automatically update your content for you. So this is the auto terms feature in Taxopress. There are some other more advanced things you can do with it. For example, under options, you can set a limit to the number of terms. So if you do have a very busy content heavy site, you're not necessarily adding hundreds of terms for each post or each product. You can decide to run the scan for published or unpublished content. In this case, if you check the box for unpublished content, it will scan your products even when they're only in draft form. And you can also go back and scan content or WooCommerce products that has already been added previously. So if you do have a busy WooCommerce site and you do want to add Taxopress now, that's perfectly possible. You can add Taxopress, you can get your settings set up, and then you can click this button to add terms to existing content and it will go back and populate all of the content you've added before Taxopress was installed. A quick note of caution, this can be a little resource intensive, so if you do have a busy site with thousands or tens of thousands of products, I would set these numbers here pretty high. This will slow down the processing, it will still work, 
but it means you're not suddenly analyzing tens of thousands of posts all at the same time. Also, in the pro version, you can set this scanning to run on a schedule, for example, daily or hourly. And then if you do need to modify how auto terms works, how it scans your content, you can do that with a bit of coding knowledge using regular expressions. But we've taken a look at a pretty basic example. We've taken a look at an example of scanning WooCommerce categories and automatically adding them to products which deserve to have those categories. This is just one of the many features you'll find inside TaxoPress. For more information, or to give TaxoPress Pro a try, head over to taxopress.com, check out the documentation, check out our blog, and hopefully we can really help speed up organizing and categorizing your WordPress site.